it's Brooke here, and today we are on the road. So we are heading to Jerome, Arizona. Um, it's just like two hours north of us. Yeah. Like two hours north of us. Um, I okay. So the reason why we want to go here, there's a few reasons. It's like super historic. It's really cool. It's all over TikTok. I don't know if you guys have seen it, but he sees it a lot on TikTok, and he showed me. And um, there's also this haunted hotel there, and I'm, I'm. I'm weird. I really like haunted stuff. Not that I like it, but me and my grandma just always used to watch the shows and everything. And I'm super interested <laughs> to know, like, are ghosts real? Because I believe in angels. And so I'm just like, you know, there's good, there's evil. So, and not all ghosts are evil either. So, well, I've heard. I don't know, but I've heard. So, we just ate breakfast. We stopped at this hot bagels and deli place and this coffee place um, about an hour and a half, uh, two hours away from Jerome. So, Super excited. I'm gonna keep you guys updated on this like two hour drive. Oh wow, I don't know where the water's coming from. Mountain probably. Oh yeah. This is really cool. I if I just drop my phone in here. Oh, the blood. Going so far. Hey guys, what was that? Hey guys, so we are back from Jerome. Um, we are home and I 
had a great day. I love that area. I love history. I love historic towns. And Jerome, Arizona is very historic. It has It's one of the oldest um, mining towns in Arizona. Uh, I, I just, I don't know, I was very overwhelmed by all the history and the people there were so nice and so sweet and I highly recommend it. The roads are a little rough there, <laughs> a little scary at times because you're on, up on a high mountain, um, but definitely worth it. Definitely recommend going there whenever you guys get a chance if you ever come out and visit Arizona. Um, but we did get a few souvenirs over there, so I just want to show you guys. One of them being this necklace. It just has like a little paw print on it for Athena. Um, I want to get a mountain. They had a mountain one, and I forgot to pick it. go back and pick it up. Uh, but Okay, so the first thing that I got from Jerome was this book about the history of Jerome. Super excited to read it. I love like American history and actually world history. And I just think this is super exciting to just know like not like just have knowledge about this town that i was in and the history beyond it and i just think it'll be a really good you know informative read and then trevor got which we're both going to share um this little mug this rose gold rose gold mold wow i can't speak but this rose gold mug and it says jerome arizona uh 1876 which i think it's when it was founded i don't know if you can really see that but he got that and he got me this necklace. And then we got, oh, this is our, our little um, sweet tooth. That place where I showed you guys a video of us eating ice cream and from that same place we got some peanut brittle. Super excited to try that, it smells like peanut brittle. <laughs> um, we got some fudge as well, which I forgot we got this actually. Uh, but we got some Butterfinger fudge and I think Rocky Road fudge. But this stuff looks amazing. Let me show you. I'm just gonna show you. It looks freaking amazing. Like look. This is the Rocky Red and this is the Butterfinger. Super excited to try that. The ice cream was amazing as well. I don't really know how they package this, but okay. Also, we went to a place called Grapes there, which Oh, it was so good. Also, the reason, one of the main reasons we went there was because the Jerome Grand Hotel is supposed to be one of the haunted places in Arizona. They actually did a ghost adventure uh, episode about it, and I'm super into that kind of ghost. I think I told you guys this at the beginning of the video. I'm super into that kind of stuff. And we went there to eat, and we were then we're gonna do. We wanted to tour the hotel, but they stopped doing tours like four years ago. How disappointing. By the way, also, if you have noticed a different, like, quality change, it's because I forgot my camera at home while we went to Jerome, so I've been using my phone, and I just decided just to go ahead and finish the video on my phone, so it wasn't, like, all over the place. Um, we got that, and then we mostly just got food souvenirs, to be quite honest, kind of what we just love to do. We are super into cooking as well, whichever it is. We love trying new, like, spices and things like that, so we're trying to not break this, because I usually break everything we buy. Um, but we got this Jerome Ghost Pepper Carolina Reaper Salsa. So excited to try this. I actually tried it at this store. It is spicy, but it's not terrible. It has really good flavor. But for a normal everyday like salsa, but a normal everyday salsa, I don't want something that spicy. So I went with the uh, Jerome Ghost Pepper Pineapple Medium. I think that'll be a good, like, in between for me. Not super spicy, but just has a little kick to it. And then, more salsa cooking things. We went ahead and got some olive oil, which you guys are like, you can buy olive oil from anywhere. Why don't you just get it from Jerome? They had so many different flavors of olive oil. Flavors. I talk about flavors of olive oil. I thought there was one. No, she had like 30. So we got the Jerome Olive Oil Traders Tuscan Herb Infused Olive Oil. And this stuff was my, this one was my favorite. Just to, you know, cook with. I think it'd be great to cook some chicken with. And then Trevor got, oh, and then I also got some truffle, black truffle sea salt, which we love truffle oil and truffle salt for fries and stuff. Um, and then Trevor got, for barbecuing, he got the olive wood smoked infused olive oil. 
And then he, and this, the lady mixed that with this other one. It's called the Neapolitan Herb Balsamic Vinegar. And he, they, she mixed this with the smoked olive oil. And just, it was the perfect flavor for grilling. Um, so that's where Trevor got that. And then to save the oils, we got these little stoppers um, so that, she told us that it saves 25% of, of the bottle. It just has, has like a little hex stopper in there. So I went ahead and bought those as well. Uh, I believe that's all we got from Jerome, but we came back with so many cool memories and experiences and I'm just so excited that we got to do that. There's so many places in Arizona that I wanna explore before we leave. I mean, we don't have orders or anything, but we never know when they're gonna drop and we don't wanna be rushing when they do drop to like explore the rest of Arizona and the West Coast because who knows when we'll be back out this way. So I'm just, we're trying to get everything like explored and just say that we've seen it all. Um, so yeah, it was a super cool day and I'm thankful that we had, we're able to do it. Um, so uh, I wanna show you guys this as well. I ha just wanna tell you guys how much I love this coffee. It's called Coffee Over Cardio and just look at this packaging. Like this packaging is just amazing. It says caffeine loading. I don't know. This is super freaking cute. And I want to show you. I got this in the mail yesterday, but I was I was busy, so I couldn't pick it up. So I picked it up when we got back today or tonight. Um, but I have the. I already have coffee over cardio cinnamon bun uh, ground coffee, and I also have the coffee over cardio espresso fit, and I love absolutely love both of them. So I went ahead and ordered more because I was running low. I got the Cinnabon again because, I don't know, it just has an amazing flavor. And then I wanted to try, because that's a medium roast, I wanted to get something a little stronger. I went ahead and got the Workflow High Buzz Ground Coffee in the Dark Roast. Super freaking excited to try this. I'm going to, try, like, pretty much every time I run low on one of them, I'm going to buy another flavor just to try it out. I also have a discount code. I'll link it. I'll put it in down here. I'll also link my link down below. So you guys get 10% off if you use my code and my link. And yeah, so let me know if you guys give it a try. Comment down below and I'll try and do like a little giveaway so I can just get back to you guys for doing it. All right, guys, well, it's been a long day. I need to go rest. I need to go get my life in order uh, because tomorrow I clean the house, do my homework, and then the next day I'm going back to work. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.